Welcome back to NRM 638, Python Scripting for ArcGIS Applications, Spring Semester 2015. This week we're going to work with a module called the ArcPy.mapping module. And this is a special module that's used with ArcMap documents or ArcMap MXD files on the hard drive. So as an example, here I have an ArcMap document that's my current document. And we've got data frame objects. And inside each data frame object, we have layer objects. And the layers have broken data sources. So if we look at the property, it's looking for the data source in this C NRM638 temp folder and it's no longer in that folder and it's no longer a shape file. So basically we could have hundreds and hundreds of map documents that have broken layers. So in your assignment this week you'll have these MXD files that all have broken layers because the source has changed. It's no longer a shape file called fire history. It's now a polygon feature class in this geo database. So you'll run your Python script and you'll fix all the broken layers in all of these MXD files. So after you run your Python script, for example, in this AK wildfires 2013-2014, all the layers now have the correct data source, which is the fire polygon inside this geo database. And then every MXD file will have the correct data source for every layer. So for example, this top three wildfires, this data frame had three layers and now the data source for these three layers is correct. It's the fire polygons inside this geo database. The other part of your assignment for this week will be working in the layout view. So in ArcMap, we have two different types of views. We have the data view where we're looking at these different data frames and then we have the layout view where we're looking at how these data frames are positioned on a sheet of paper and then we're also looking at layout elements like layout title, legend, scale bar, north arrow, etc. So in your assignment what you'll do is write a Python script that loops through this layer and changes the definition query to match the top 10 years in terms of the largest years of total hectares burned in Alaska. And then for each of those top 10 years, create a PDF page showing all those fires for that year. And then we'll append all those PDF pages into a multi-page map book. So we run our Python script and your Python script creates these individual PDFs. So for example, 2004 was the record year for the most hectares burned in Alaska. So we have the top 10 years. And then basically you append these top 10 years with a cover page into one PDF file that would be a multiple page map book. So here's an example of a multiple page map book and we have under document properties the title top, top largest wildfire years in Alaska from 1940 to 2014, your authorship, the subject, keywords, etc. And then basically we have one page for each year of the top 10 years in terms of largest area burn for that year from 1940 to 2014. Okay, so if you go to the Blackboard website, ArcPy mapping is very object oriented. So the first video session will be working with the map document object. And that's either the currently opened map document or MXD files that are on your hard drive. And then once you've finished with that, then we'll do a session on data frame objects, a session on map layer objects, a session on fixing broken layer layer broken data sources, a session on working in the map layout, and then our final session will be creating PDF map books. And this week all the video sessions are open, there's no quiz questions, so basically you would just go through 
through this sequence of video sessions.